welcome. My name is Magdalene Janet. If you're new, welcome to the fam. Please don't forget to like and subscribe because we're always here having a good time. And come visit me on TikTok and Instagram because I'm always there now. And of course, welcome back to my oldies but goodies. So you guys, lip swatching time. I get so excited when a drugstore lipstick drop and you guys nyx just dropped their very viral famous xxl lipsticks in six new shades that i bought at ulta it's the fuego line i'm so freaking excited to test these out for you and show you how they look in studio lighting and in daylight you know per the usual i have nothing on my lips which is why i look a little crusty but I always start without anything on my lips so you guys can see the true color. I won't wear any lip liners or anything on my lips. You guys have to see the deal, you know? So I'm gonna just get this shade, which is number 25, Candela Babe. Ooh, I love it. Okay, it's their same applicator, same packaging from their original. If you don't know what I'm talking about, ooh, they have a little sweet smell. Oh my God, did I get some on my nose? No. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I did lip swatch. 10 of the original shades that released last year you guys really like that video so i'm like why not do another one with the brand new shade and it's only six shades so it's not too like overwhelming you know so if you are new what i usually do is i lip swatch everything at the beginning and then towards the end of the video we talk all things nyx xxl lipstick so before we get started i do want to show you the order i'm gonna go in on my phone and then let's just start the lip swatches all right fam we're gonna ignore our brush right there because it's holding everything together this is the order we're gonna go in this is the fuego line so pretty and we're actually going in the order of numbers you see and oh my god i'm so freaking excited first one up is candela babe number 25 I don't Next one up is number 26, Getting Caliente. I can't just let you back in. And in daylight, this is getting caliente. Next one up is 27 on Fuego. Next one up is 29 Hot Caramelo. This is the shade Hot Caramelo. And in daylight, this is Hot Caramelo. Ooh, 
last but not least is number 30, this Lula. God, these shades are so freaking beautiful. I'm really shocked. But let me first give you some info about these bad boys. So these are the new NYX Lip Lingerie XXL Matte Lipsticks. These are the new Six Fuego shades. They retail for $9.50. These are a 16-hour transfer-proof lipstick with a smooth matte finish. It creates the appearance of smooth, fuller-looking lips. Extra fiery shades designed for warm and deep skin tones. This flexible formula provides lip color that moves with you. It is 100% vegan and cruelty free i loved each and every one of them except the orange one right here well not that i didn't like it but at the beginning it's super super bright and i just feel like it didn't look well on my skin tone but they do oxidize a little bit so once they dry down they do get a little bit darker which is totally fine i did these swatches on my arm and i actually want to show you the swatches in daylight and they look so beautiful these were all just one swipe very very highly highly pigmented which is really nice because you don't use a lot of product when a lipstick is pigmented you don't have to continue to swipe as you can see in these swatches it looks bomb and what i'm very surprised about is how you know how i went with the reds first i should have gone last with them but these last shades well these shades in general are that pigmented where it went over the red because the reds did stain the lips just a little bit so i was really surprised because look you can't even see like the red bleeding through at all they are matte Let's do a kiss test yeah a little bit came off when it comes to matte lipsticks in order for them to like not transfer you have to let them dry i always say give it at least five minutes and if you're gonna layer it layer it in thin layers because if you glob on a lot it's gonna take longer to dry and clumps can actually come off if you touch something that's the general rule when it comes to matte lipsticks these are super comfortable this formula is one of my favorite formulas when i tried it out last year when they first released the initial shade i just like it because it's super comfortable it's not drying doing all these lip swatches my, my lips did not feel like they were drying or on fire which usually happens because i'm lip swatching a bunch of lipstick it shows a little bit of texture as you can see i do have very textured lips depending how your lips are it's gonna show texture i don't really like this so to avoid that because i do love matte lipsticks i always go in with a little bit of my AMD ointment like a very thin layer and then go in with the matte lipstick and the applicator is bomb it's the triangular appl applicator that they have in the original formula is the same from the previous one you know how sometimes when shades are either added or changed the formula doesn't stay the same but it is the same so i'm very very happy about that all of these shades were my favorite shades let me know which one's your favorite because i'm kind of feeling this one you know i love nyx nyx is killing the game right now they just released the lip liners that i just swatched maybe about a week ago and those are so bomb i actually have some that i thought looked very similar i thought that Untam untainable was very close to stamina and it's not like off the package you can see it's not but let me do a swatch really quick untainable is the one closest to my fingers stamina is next to it oh yeah oh i love untainable you see how this one's it's a true here it's a tr oh girl it's a true red this is the new one this is the old one the old one has a bit of a blue undertone i love blue undertone reds though those are my jam they're not similar because i really thought they were but i'm like they shouldn't you know we need new new shades like completely new different undertones and everything and the undertones of these are beautiful like these with the lip liner oh, girl you guys the sun is beaming today i'm so happy because yesterday was super gloomy so i wasn't sure how sunny it was gonna be today but it all worked out which is it just always makes me so happy oh my god do i have anything in my teeth as i'm talking 
I kind of do, but it's okay. I just love when the sun is shining. It literally makes me happy. And then when I'm doing the swatches, I feel like I'm sunbathing for that, like for those few seconds, you know? Yeah, fam, this is it. Just wanted to show you guys how these look. They look so beautiful. And yeah, let me know your thoughts. Have you seen these around? Are you planning to pick up the new shades? Did you buy the original when they first came out? You know what? I'm going to do a quick wear test because someone asked me. I forgot who. I'm so sorry. I'll, I'll put her comment here she missed me doing wear tests for my lip swatches I can do them sometimes I can't always do them because sometimes I go to the gym and I just have to take all of my makeup off but I'm not going to the gym today and I'm gonna go eat tonight so I'll enter the wear test right here and we can see how these bad boys wear Hey guys, so here I am. I finished eating. Look at this lipstick. It looks so good. And look, and it doesn't look like crappy, you see? And I was grubbing. You guys saw all that food. I was devouring, but it was so bomb. I just want to do this quick check-in. Definitely long-lasting. Okay, bye. I love you guys so much. Thank you for hanging out with me and spending a little bit of your day with me. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, click the button right there, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.